Hi friends, today we are going to learn the midpoint formula. We recently learned in the previous video uh, the section formula of the coordinate geometry. Uh, the section formula, let me uh, a brief, let me uh, do once again, right? Suppose this is a line, uh, it is AB, right? And its comma, its coordinate are x1, y1, and it's another point that's x2, y2, b. And here is a point somewhere, suppose here, suppose that's point P whose coordinates are X and Y, right? This is unknown, right? And this both are given. And this point is now dividing this or secting this in the ratio of M1 ratio M2, right? So now we have to find out the formula for this point, right? So for this, the formula XY is equals to M1 X2 plus M2 X1 whole divided by m1 plus m2 this is x coordinate and the y coordinate is again m1 y2 right plus m2 y1 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right this is the section formula we recently learned this is in some ratios right now uh, let's observe a particular uh, condition right suppose this is a line again the same line uh, this is a line which has x1 and y1 coordinate and this is b line which has x2 and y2 right coordinate now uh, let's suppose uh, let me do with this color fine this is now point p exactly at the midpoint right exactly at the center exactly means uh, this is p point now and its coordinate is now let's so uh, let's say it's x y again right but it is exactly equal right means a p is equals to this a p distance is exactly right exactly equals to p v distance so it is exactly at the middle point right so now what is the coordinate or what is the formula to find out this coordinates right now what when we what we can say in this condition that this p point is dividing this a b in one ratio one right we can simply say it because uh, see here this part and this part are equal so let me suppose here uh, I don't have to suppose even because here m1 is 1 again and again m2 is also 1 right so it's a ratio of m1 in uh, m1 used to m2 right so now let me find the value of xy by using this m1 and m2 here right so again here x y will be right see this m1 right m1 is 1 this is x2 again m2 is again 1 and it is x1 right whole divided by m1 plus m2 that is 1 plus 1 and again see m1 m1 is again 1 and this is y2 right again plus m2 is again 1 and this is y1 right so y1 it's uh, like this so now let's divide so I will get m1 is again 1 and m2 is again 1 right so let me close the bracket and now what we got 1 into x2 and 1 into x1 so simply I can write x1 plus x2 whole divided by 2 and again y1 plus y2 whole divided by 2 I'm just uh, keeping this x2 back side and y2 this back side right uh, it is easy to remember 1 2 1 2 right and 1 that this 2 2 so this point this formula right this x y formula that uh, equals to this x coordinate and this y coordinate is x1 plus x2 open 2 or y1 plus y2 open 2 so what we're seeing over here there <coughs> let me tell you here this 1 and 2 upon 2 this is an average exactly right this is an average in the uh, uh, you have learned in mean median mode that right it's exactly the mean or average of this point two points right here I mean to say this is exactly the average of these two points x1 and x2's average is this x part and y1 and y2's average is this part right this is called the midpoint formula exactly right uh, this is called midpoint formula right this is called midpoint formula midpoint formula this is exactly no more than the average average of two right let me do in this figure right uh, I think here 
the red will be best or oh, this blue okay suppose uh, this coordinate this is origin right so it is zero zero of course and this is one this is two three four five this is again one two three four five right suppose there is a line mm, that suppose it is here so it is one two right uh, and here is another point that is C it's one and one two so its coordinates are one two and here is five and then one two three four right so its coordinates are five four right now I have to take the middle of this right exactly middle of this uh, it will be about here right so this point is the middle of this right exactly so it's exactly the average you know uh, I told you already it is the average so average of 1 and 5 now I have to take what is the average of 1 and 5 simply I will be uh, average of 1 and 5 right so mm, let me change the color fine right so average of 1 and 5 so s I simply add this both 1 plus 5 divided by 2 that will be equals to 6 by 2 that is 3 right so x coordinate is now 3 again uh, average of this 2 and 4 or I can say mean of this 2 and 4 again let me take here 2 plus 4 divided by 2 that is again 4 plus 2 6 upon 2 equals to 3 so again I got the value y value 3 right so this is also 3 3 see here 1 2 3 1 2 3 so it's simply the average right it's a uh, mean point formula is just the average of two coordinates right just take the average of uh, the um, uh, average or mean you can say simply uh, if you're learning the statistics then it's simply the mean right so if you just apply this formula again here you'll also get the same value right see just I'm applying here suppose this is xy so xy I will get right x1 plus x2 upon 2 so x1 here is let me suppose this is x1 y1 x1 y1 right and this is x2 y2 right it is working as x2 y2 so x1 plus uh, x2 that is again 1 plus 5 divided by 2 and y1 plus y2 that is 2 plus 4 y1 plus y2 divided by 2 right is equals to right 1 plus 5 that is 6 upon 2 2 plus 4 that is 6 upon 2 right so again 3 coordinate 3 comma 3 so this is the midpoint of these two points so simply this is called mid, uh, midpoint formula exactly it's nothing just take the average of the coordinates right take the average of x coordinate and take the average of y coordinate and the average that you got that is exactly the coordinate of the midpoint right in any line uh, simply say, uh, j as we take an example here right simply in any line if you have to take out the midpoint and the coordinates of that midpoint so simply add the x coordinate right add the x part x coordinates and take the average of this uh, I mean uh, by 2 divide it by 2 and again take the add the y coordinates and divide by 2 you will get those two coordinates which are the exactly the midpoints you will get the coordinates of midpoints okay so this is simply a midpoint formula I think you now understand it and in next video we will be doing uh, lots of problem related to this section formula and midpoint formula okay so keep watching on we will be meeting next video bye bye